the songs come from somewhere else, right? I mean, these are like gifts to me, and then I mold them, and then I produce them, and arrange them in the way that I think I hear them. And then when I put it out, it's not, it's really not mine anymore. You know, it's, it's for the audience and it's for the listener. And do I want people to listen to it? Absolutely. Do I want people to buy it? Absolutely. Do I want heavy rotation? Definitely. Do I want placement on Grey's Anatomy and get taken all the plants in a film? Absolutely. You know, would I take a Charmin commercial for my song, Go Easy On Me? Absolutely. You know. The record starts with a song called Wreck Me, which I wrote in November while I was on tour with Ani DeFranco, and that song was written while I was on tour, and I had a weekend uh, affair with another musician that was fantastic. And the idea came to me, this is a long weekend, we're gonna hang out, I'm willing to let you wreck me. Oh, oh no, here comes the flood. As your you know, I knew we weren't going to be together. I knew it was nothing else was going to come of this. It was just we were hanging out, we were writing, both artists. Uh, it was very, uh, it was very cool. person's much much younger than me so she's in a very different place in her life mm. and in her career that's the whole verse about uh, I want I'm going home dreaming of a nursery and you are standing still shining up your gate um, while I am trying to quit everything you are lacing up your skates Shining up your gate. Kind of like that looking at someone mm -hmm. across the table being like, you're just getting ready to start. Mm -hmm. You're just starting doing this thing I've been doing for 20 years and, mm -hmm. and I want to go home and, and uh, take in all the plants kind of a thing. Well, 